everyone i hope you all are fine today in this video i will tell you about response farming and about terra farming so first of all let us start with response farming the term response farming has been coined by stewart in the year 1988 so response farming refers to the prediction of monsoon season based on the analysis of weather data of previous monsoon season and managing the crops accordingly so here in case of response farming we try to predict the monsoon season the upcoming monsoon season based on the analysis of weather data of previous monsoon season for example let us take the example of southwest monsoon so by considering the rainfall which we have received during southwest monsoon in the last year we will try to predict the rainfall which we will be receiving during the southwest monsoon of this year so response farming is all about prediction of monsoon season prediction of upcoming monsoon season based on the analysis of weather data of previous monsoon season response farming plays an important role for farmers in choosing their crops in selecting cropping patterns and in planning their intercultural operations so this is all about response farming now we will move on to the terra farming terra farming is of scientific interest but not for commercial cultivation the only objective of terra farming is to develop mars planet according to its environmental condition so at now at present some of the bacteria and plants are being developed by creating environmental conditions of mars or earth so the basic objective of terra farming is to develop mars planet according to its environmental condition so this farming is highly of scientific approach and it is not for commercial cultivation so this is all about terra farming and response farming thanks for watching this video see you all soon with more exciting content thank you one and all